Hello and welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we give you the biggest entertainment stories and sometimes analyze them for you. I mean, I think that's every time. My name is Elsie Godwin, and I've got my co-anchors with me, Ife Oluwa Oshunkeye and Nimi Dekombe. Hey, guys. Bang, How bang. you doing? Ah, finally, he has it's another signature. We thank you, Lord. It's not gang, gang, gang. Mm. No, bang, bang. Mm -hmm. right. How you guys doing? Yeah. Not bad, not bad, not bad. I'm good. We are managing. Uh, we are managing. What are you managing? You are the one that told us. From the dirty December. No, she told us she's <laughs> fine. I'm forgetting that. Oh, true. She's not feeling the dirtiness. And your birthday yeah. is coming up, so you should manage. When is your birthday again? January 29th. Oh, it's too far. <laughs> uh, okay, good night now. Anyways, um, singer Harry Song has spoken to Instagram or has taken to Instagram to plead with the team and management of Instagram to stop holding his account hostage, stating that they have been holding his account hostage at 1.5 million followers for more than six months. In his words, he says, This is one of the quickest and easiest means to reach and connect with my fans around the world. Mm -hmm. But I'm disappointed at the team and management of Instagram for being unfair to me please tag them okay mm. <laughs> <laughs> well Which one is everybody is affected by this sometimes yeah. you see some people you're following and you're wondering when did i start following this person mm -hmm. and all of that or even when did i unfollow this person uh, yeah mm -hmm. when did i unfollow this person and all of that so i think a lot of people are affected even those of us that don't have up to mm -hmm. 1.5 million, million followers, followers that are misplaced affected so i think it's something yeah. instagram should look into but I, 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 I think it's not only instagram because even like i wouldn't say that even on twitter there have been people complaining okay they are like being suspended mm -hmm. you know without and even some people have course, i think and they are earlier, their followers so. i think late last year mm -hmm. a lot of people were not able to post they were not able on to instagram? Uh, on instagram they were not able to post they were not mm -hmm. able to comment they were not yeah. able to yeah. i think instagram was yeah. down during that period uh, yeah if so they are down that happens generally issues. and yeah. then sometimes if you use a link that is not accepted by Instagram, they sometimes ban you from um, commenting until you actually find that link, go back mm. and remove that link. Then you can mm. now use captions and all that. So you see this Instagram and Twitter stress, it's yeah. just too much. And I feel like it's actually points and into some of these people's gallery because like one of the things that all those um, people do is when you want to like do advertisements for smaller brands so you tell them that okay i have 2.5 million followers who come and advertise on my page for this certain amount but if 1.5 million followers is now missing from your supposed 2.5 million followers it would affect your business mm -hmm. so it's not just about okay maybe he's not reaching his fans it's also about maybe he has a side hustle from advertising on Instagram. Mm. And then but the owners, the owners of the platform affect. also wants to make money. So it could exactly. also they know what they are doing. Exactly. It's somebody's platform. Yeah, so it could also affect um, you from getting a lot of um, endorsement, endorsement yeah. deals mm. and all of that. Because yeah. um, I think before you get endorsement, you have to have a certain, a certain amount of mm. So um, if you don't have that, so I understand where it could be it's very painful. From. I think mm. you also mentioned some time ago that you lost about 100 followers or 200 or something That's like Twitter. that. That's Twitter. Okay, that was on Twitter. Mm, so yeah. it's not just it's across all yeah, social it media. And all the, the social thing media is, but you know they have their rules, right? But they you know you're a boss now. The next day it, you came by and said that you gained them back in two days. You know, like, she's boss lady. Man. Okay. <laughs> Let's move on to the Malian vibe. Naramali reacts as pastor declares him a demon, saying Jesus never went to church. So we, we talked about this at the pre, on the previous episode, yeah. Yeah. where Apostle, what's his name again, Omashola, was saying that yeah. um, he's Apostle demonic. Is a demon. Uh -huh. it's, it's so, music is satanic. Yeah. But Naramali saying Jesus never went to church, is that true? No, but that's, is, that's why I'm not true. saying that. The synagogue uh, is the church. The so temple maybe, is the church. church. Mm -hmm. Anywhere two or three people are gathered in his name is a church. He actually he even went to a church because a church. they majorly called it the synagogue yes. and I he think goes there to teach, to heal. Yeah. Remember when they said he was healing upset. on the Sabbath day? Yeah, Where was he doing? Can you church. remember when he was upset that yeah, people, people were, were even selling in, in the church. temple? So, and, yeah, church yeah, church. Yeah. 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 He's truly so, not a... He's, he's not probably a not a demon, but he's not a Christian. No, Naimali is not a Christian. His name No, no, no. It's a proper Muslim. Exactly. I don't expect... I don't think anybody 
somebody should take Naira Mali as a, you know, as an authority when it comes to like Christian matters he has or deleted, spiritual matters. Yeah, because it was obviously from a very, yeah. very ignorant. Yeah, it was like, a very ignorant because people must have come from like, I don't know, yeah. guy, no, Jesus went to church. They'll give yeah, him. but I think yeah. I can. But you know, there are some, there, there are some Afis that are Christians. They are just yeah, of course. Switched. Maybe they switch. So Naira you have Mali to tell us, is it? Yeah, you're sure about that. Very, very sure. Okay. I don't know. Malians would know. No, no, no. Even when he posted that picture of his um of his um cars he still put a lamb do the lie or yeah. something oh, like that so okay. he yeah. it with a so yeah, how a how is the, an apostle Muslim. saying um so like you, you, you guys, like how does Jesus not going to church affect what you know Pastor Omar Shola said about him? Maybe he's just trying no, to No, I think I don't I'm not I don't sure understand the if correlation. This is Omar Shola because they said they also said um somebody like, another prophet gave a he's list a of prophet. people. I think it's just a Twitter user that yeah, says Twitter user that 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 Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's that's right. That so I don't think this has so anything to do with Omar Shola. No, I think it's also no, reacting I mean, to the right Yeah, yeah, yeah it's reacting to everything. Too. But yeah. this particular one about someone who, the people that won't make it from um, is actually from the Twitter user. Mm. Who's I think he was just being sarcastic, Twitter savage. It wasn't anything yeah. really. I don't think and it was I don't know if you guys yeah. saw the viral video, all this... Um, Funny crack TV. Yeah, that they said that which artist do you, you think will not make heaven? Almost all of them were saying that. Nah, not almost. I think like, <laughs> <laughs> everyone. Almost said, all of them were saying that. And they like, asked them why. They said because he has no manners. Yeah, <laughs> they, 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 they were just funny. Yeah, so I think um, Mali should. Um, I think somebody should before he puts out a tweet, before mm. he puts out a mm -hmm. post, he should actually do further research. This is the before. only tweet he has actually put out that seems to be yeah out that, of that, was, that, that yeah, seems to be wrong. Out of face, I think TV. I think we can just let Naramali be. Mm. Um, the this conversation is, should be on. Then the I kind think of it's like time Naramali pays us on this table because I don't think there's a we, week that goes by that without we, don't we don't talk, talk about, about Naramali. Oh, that, that, if that's the case, there are a lot of people that own can you West too? Can you West? Davido. Davido. Ah, Davido is our Davido. best <laughs> so, On this table, Davido yeah. is doing us millions. Exactly. <laughs> it's time for a quick break, but when we return, we definitely have more stories to discuss. We'll be right back. Welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we bring you the biggest entertainment stories and, of course, analyze them for you. You can have both parents and still end up as a useless child at the scene every day. <laughs> <laughs> Most times I worry more about where I'm coming from mm -hmm. and where I am now. Wow. And that determines my next step. Why are you sounding like an Alibaba? Alibaba. Oh, <laughs> plus TV Africa, we're feeling good. No time to do it, everybody feeling all right. Some say they look myself minimal are you? Mm. Akpala music is for mature minded people. I got DM sometimes from Malawi like woo! Sleeping early, sleeping early. This is still Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. I learned all these slangs from my hood in Benin, and this is coming from Rema as he responds to Twitter user who jokingly insinuated that a young artist might be misleading foreigners with lyrics on his song titled Lady, stating that those lyrics are not in any way, shape, or form in Nigerian language. Rema, however, responded saying, and I quote, I learned all these slangs from my hood in Benin City. They all actually have meaning. I create sounds freely. I cannot limit my creativity because of what people will think. I'm confident in my vibe, accept it. Thank you. End of quote. Yeah. I think I think that that really really that's oh, yeah. the song. I right? want to be your lover. Yeah, repata, repata. <laughs> there was an interview I saw. Yeah. Um, it wasn't on this song. It was on mm -hmm. the one that blew him up. Do maybe. Do maybe. So they were asking him what he meant, mm -hmm. and by himself. He said he meant nothing. <laughs> so, like maybe. most of the, yeah. I don't know how he said it, but some of the things he said. <laughs> so he said he was just in the studio and he was just vibing. That like he really meant nothing, right? So now that he's coming with another vibe, maybe it's for lady and saying he means something. So I think he needs to come and break it down and tell us yeah. what they really mean because okay, last so last, think, it's um, a vibe and we're enjoying the vibe. Yeah, it's not exactly. that deep. From, not where, that deep. from where, from, from where it's coming from, I think I can understand the beats because um, 
Edo people. You can understand what? A bit of what he's talking okay, about. Okay, a bit. Not the beat. beat. <laughs> no, no, a bit of what he's talking about okay. because Edo. Uh, worry, they have a lot, they of, have a lot of slangs yeah. that we don't even use in that Lagos. Do you understand that? Uh, that you hear, yeah, you'll be like, ah, which one be this one again? Yeah. I guess yeah. the guy that was yeah. talking still was right because he said it's not a language, like it's not a Nigerian language. Yeah, but it's, it's a slang. It's, it's like, like a it's slang, still not a language. Like, like a lingo, lingo. Like, like a lingo. lingo. Yeah. Probably like a lingo that they have in. It's, it's like it's like, like no kind of cap. Stuff. No cap is not a language, but everybody uses no cap now, and it means no lies. No I'm for real. Like when you say okay, it's, it is just like an indigenous slang. Okay, sing yeah. that song again. Um, that part you're singing, lady song. What does it mean? Oh yeah, you probably mean something. No, See, I'm going by what he said, though. by himself. Oh. In no, in that was maybe not. No, this one maybe was. Well, this one has a bit. So maybe this one. I'll be patient and wait for when he will come out to tell us what. Yeah, I think we should probe him further and tell us that okay, these slangs, what exactly do they mean? Because when worried people say things like "shoot bed in mama fly," you know things like that. They they break it down. You actually know what "shoot bed in mama fly" means. You know. But we also sing songs and we don't know what he means. I mean, we see that has not come out to make it sound like he was trying to be deep. He tells you it's a vibe, you enjoy the vibe, but we know it's a vibe. It's it's not, he has not come out to tell you it's one at that a that level, level like only something. Even when they asked, I saw an interview lyrics. when they asked um, Whiskey Juro and he had to pause for a while and think, mm. what does Juro mean? What does Juro mean? Then he now said, I think it means, means enjoyment. He was saying, I think. You but understand? So, so I think so. Rema is not the only one. Rema is not the only Nigerian. But people need to understand that um, creativity is not all about um, what is our indigenous language. Sometimes, sometimes mm. when you're in the studio, you just get in the vibe and you mm. just feel like, okay, this goes. Mm. It may not necessarily have a meaning at that time, but when it grows into people, be, people begin to coin it into certain things and mm -hmm. they start using it for certain context and mm. when they're speaking, you understand? Like There are so many uh, slangs that have been born from just listening to songs. To even song. in the hood, like even in the hip-hop culture, there are so many slangs mm. that probably heard it from yeah, a song no from a rap or something. I can't relate <laughs> Okay. So we were hood star. Uh, <laughs> you're not a Malian. Now. Now. So you're not a Malian. I'm not a Malian. I'm sorry. Ah, you're the only person on this um, tea time table that is not a Malian. It's Benny Hack has been converted to a Malian. I mean, Ewa is, Ewa is the, a is she's yeah, a queen of Malians. Malians. Yeah, yeah, I'm an online Malian. You are still a Malian. Mm -hmm. okay. I betrayed Malians so they are wearing belts. <laughs> but it's, it's, it's okay for one person to stay on the sidelines. I like mm. the Shumole though. Really? Yeah. The Shmala is the song you like? Yeah, Out I like of all the Shmala. It's not, it's not a church song, go. I mean, yeah, I like that. There's a meaning. I mean, he, oh, even when you people are saying yeah. that he That's says, he says yeah. things. That one, I mm -hmm. think I can vibe to it and sing to mm -hmm. it anytime. But how can somebody that is in demon now be saying they should step on his father? <laughs> hey. I don't understand. Wait, step on, oh, yes, now he's a demon, so how can he be saying they should step on his father? I think, in, I think in a demon world, they have like leverage and leeways and like you can do anyhow. We know you mm. still <laughs> I don't know. Okay, what? Okay, so I don't know. know. I don't know. She, 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 she's not a Malian, but she's a demon. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on to the next story, I do not trust any word that comes out of the mouth of a man, and this is coming from American singer Justin Sky. Elsie, you look very, very beautiful. You are very, very beautiful. There's a difference between facts and the words that come out of your mouth. Mm. Deep. Ah. Deep. 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 Deep.
day I don't believe what a man says. I look at what he does because yeah. I think I was they're, say that, I think they're just yeah. smooth talkers. It's not just about so, it's not just about men. Mm, I think generally we know the angle. We are, it's relationship matter we are talking about. So whatever he says, then in that case, look at what he's doing. That comes out from a woman's mouth. You're very important you? to me, but your but you have what he's doing shows you that you're not important. Bills. Follow what he's doing. Leave what he's saying. Well, you guys I have a strong point, point there, and um, I'm I'm not going to say that. Um, all men are perfect, but obviously they're the good ones out there. And mm. I'm not going to say that um, all women are perfect, but we all know that they're the good women out there. So mm. um, it's it's not okay to generalize it because um, some men, they don't actually use the L word, like I love you, until they actually mean it. Mm. Sometimes you tell a man I love you, and then it takes him months before he can even tell you I love you too. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. No, you wonder why, because they actually want to mean what they say. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? So it's okay. I understand that some men can be scum, <laughs> but not all men. Look at that guy looking at But like, not all men. Bro, no, 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 no. Bro. Right now, I want you guys to look at my lips and believe the what, words. What, I don't understand. What's on your lips? Why are you looking at your lips? I don't no, understand. No, believe the words that come out of my mouth See, right I now. get what you're saying. I totally yeah, do. So. I mean, there are women that are scum. There are yeah. men that are full. If I, there are more gender. scum men, you yeah. know, but there are even what more I'm scum saying, men too. regardless of what Justin has said or uh, mm -hmm. what she has not said, see, Watch what they do. Follow what they do. Make your decisions by their actions, not, yeah, not by, what, by what. In fact, okay, I like that you want to take it away from relationship, and that that that's fine also. So yeah. whatever area you're looking at it from, look at their actions. Forget their words. People just say things. Even things, love, you're talking exactly. about. People say, people say love. They don't know the meaning. You Friendship, understand? they use it. They don't know the meaning. Yeah. So just go by what they do. Judge Forget about actions. what they say. Yeah. Yeah. So I think um, mission 2020 because we're not doing vision. We're not doing vision again. Yeah, so because we're vision doing is mission. by mouth. Yeah. Vision is by action. So mission 2020, when a man says certain things watch out for the, for the actions before you believe those words mm. so it's okay you know the not bible to... says faith without work mm -hmm. is is dead ah, you don't know, you don't know are, you a, are you a full malian ah are you a demon <laughs> <laughs> Okay, before we go on this very quick break, here is good news for all cake lovers. For all cake and pastry needs, please visit Race and Postnet. I, I hope I got that. Yeah. They have got wedding cakes. I might not know how to pronounce their name, but I know how to eat good cakes. And I can tell you their cakes are lovely. So they have birthday cakes, cupcakes, wedding cakes, any kind of cakes, and whatever whatever your pastry desire is, just go to Race and Postnet Cake on Instagram. You should um, check them out and um, we'll be right back. Welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we bring you the biggest entertainment stories and, of course, analyze them for you. You can have both parents and still end up as a useless child at the scene every day. <laughs> <laughs> Most times, I worry more about where I'm coming from mm -hmm. and where I am now, wow. and that determines my next step. Why are you sounding like Ali Alibaba? Alibaba. Right <laughs> oh, Plus TV Africa, we're feeling good. No time to die, everybody feeling all right. And people are still buying. Sometimes I look myself, minimal mm. are you? Mm. music is for mature-minded people. That got DM sometimes from Malawi, like, woo! Sleeping early, sleeping prays for compassion after his brother gets arrested for stepfather's death. Mm. I think this is a very complicated situation. Yeah. I think we need to put it out there because a lot of people thought um, it was um, the guy, his brother, um, Slim Jimmy, Slim from Jimmy, Ray that, Shremmer, Yeah, But it's not. But it's, it's not. It's actually his half brother, Michael, the youngest. The son of this stepfather. Yes. Oh. The one they are yeah. arrested. So okay. the stepfather the raised them is. since they were in middle school. Their mm. mom was part of the military. She moved mm. around a lot. And, um, when she got married to somebody else, he had two sons. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. And he's actually the one who is suspect, who is the suspect, suspect right now, is the, the youngest. youngest. He's just 19 years old. This guy is 26. His elder brother is, I think, is 28 or something mm -hmm. like that. That's Slim Jimmy, mm -hmm. and um, is not Slim Jimmy because a lot of yeah, people are thinking, people think, thinking, Slim you know, it's Slim Jimmy, and Slim, Slim Jimmy, Jimmy is, is actually the, el is the eldest brother. of this 
um, Sueli. Okay. Do you understand? So, he, yeah. and they send his youngest brother. Yeah. So, um, so, at the end of the day, people should know that it's Michael. So, yeah. the case Thank is. Thank you for that clarification. Yeah. yeah. And then the case is um, he has actually gone for um, psych evaluation first mm -hmm. and he has been released from the hospital and he has been arrested for murder. So, I think they have actually um, confirmed that he's that mentally he's stable. No, Wait. that he's mentally stable because they had, okay. uh, went for a psych But is it confirmed that he was the one who killed his father? No, he's not. He's still a suspect. Yeah. He's, he's innocent until yeah. proven guilty. Yeah. So uh -huh. anything, there could be a twist now and then he will come out. So yeah. it hasn't been confirmed, but he has been arrested for murder. Mm -hmm. yeah. Do you understand? I so, think it's just a very sad way to start the year for Sueli. Mm. And again, looking at the fact that, I'm, me personally, I'm just tired of all of these kind of situations where people are shot dead. And it happens a lot, especially in the black community. I don't know if it is gangster related the violence. The gun control you don't know what should actually come The to gun play. control, I, I feel like in the United States of America, they should seriously start looking into gun control and they should limit the amount of people that are able to access these guns because the amount of people that are dying by being fatally shot, it's it's becoming well, even in much. Nigeria where we have gun control, let's look at the um, Abuja Ice, um, one, one of the robbers, <laughs> when, they were, <laughs> when, they were, when, they, when they were into um, interrogating him yeah. and they said, um, the guy said that uh, getting a gun is not a problem. Mm. Do you understand? So I think some people actually find it easy to easy get, get guns. Maybe it's like, no, maybe bad compared to Nigeria. Nigeria. Compared, compared to the US, well, I think it's still hard. In the US, yeah. you can get to a store, a gun store, and yeah, you actually buy a gun. You have yeah, to be on that G. Yeah. So there are so many people that are losing their lives because of you know being shot, being not shot. I'm like, but, but I'm just wondering what the motive could be because it's on, it's really funny when they say, oh, somebody killed this father. Killed but it is not confirmed that he was the one who killed his dad, though. It's possible that maybe. Well, they said he's the, the only person of interest right now. That is, there's no other. Yes, we'll have to keep watching the yeah, space. Yeah, the space and see how, how the story develops. Look at the Nigerian guy that stabbed the sister, his pregnant sister, to death to the um, NFL. No, the Texas University football mm -hmm. player. That start the sister to so I'm wondering how people can actually take the lives of their own family members because I think that's where the highest love didn't, is supposed to exist. Didn't Ken kill Abel? I mean, come on, what is the, the okay. highest love? Ken killed Abel. I mean, Do you know the story? Do you know the story? story? I know, no, 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 oh, no. Not that come much on. of a <laughs> It's like, it be very, very so. shocking sometimes. The people who who might be your greatest enemies can be those who are around you because I watch a lot of like IDX and. Um, um, all these crime stories. Investigation. The first people they suspect when somebody dies are the people around them, their family members. And they're usually, like they're usually the... And they are usually the culprits at the end of the day because they're the ones who have more access to you. So mm. when something Especially when happens, you watch a lot of CSI and um, CSI, you get you see, you see all, all of those things, things and you, you realize that people kill people that they love for very, very weird reasons. So it's but I'm just surprising. wondering what the motive could be people if it's actually guilty. People they are supposed to mm -hmm. love. But it's really sad and um, it's really a sad um, beginning of the year for, for Sui Lee yeah. and yeah. Um, yeah. Slim yeah. Jamie. Yeah. And in fact, the family at large, they are the popular ones. That's why we're talking. Talking mm, about yeah. this grief. True. Now, he, there's, this guy has another son, the late um, stepdad, has another son, son, apart from this one, we suspected, do you understand? Mm -hmm. Who is older than both Sueli and Slim Jimmy and the rest of this them. This family feud makes me remember um, the. I don't know if you guys saw the story of the young man who said he brought out clothes for his. his uh, Sister to wash, mm. and she didn't wash the clothes, uh. <laughs> and there's a problem or something. <laughs> okay, that's like another story for another day, uh, but that's so our wrap up peace, this yeah, episode so of Tea Time. Thank you for watching, and you can watch this um, conversation all over again by subscribing to our YouTube channel, A Plus TV Africa. You can also watch Tea Time on Auto TV and in London on Ben Television. My thank you as always go to my co anchors, Nimi Dekombi and Ifel Wash, okay, and the entire production team. My name is Elsie Godwin saying thank you for watching and stay beautiful.